Um, you guys, we're gonna go from the ice to uh, heating it up a little bit with our hot takes. As I mentioned at the top of the show, my fingernails are gone yeah. from that final right. four game, Tyler. So let's start off with you. Listen, I'll, I'll be honest. I'll be frank. Be, be frank right now. Lay it down. Tim knows this. I didn't watch any of the game. Still, I have the audacity, <laughs> and I think I'm in the right, to say that that Mississippi State win over UConn, the most improbable win we have seen in the past 365 days. Go back to Villanova's win over UNC. Go back to Tom Brady's comeback in the Super Bowl. Go back to the Cavs erasing a 3-1 deficit in the NBA Finals. Go back to the Cubs erasing a 3-1 deficit in the MLB Finals. MLB World Series is what that's also called. This was more improbable. A team right. that had won 111 straight games. A team that had beaten this very state, Mississippi State Bulldog team by 60 in the previous year. They were 21 and a half point favorites. I'm sorry, but this was the most improbable win. It wasn't a championship game, it's a final four game, but this is the most improbable win we've seen in the last 365 days. Include Clemson over Alabama on that. We've been treated to some great entertainment, some great theater we have. in all athletic fields. This was the most shocking, the most improbable win that we have seen in the last 365 days. Yeah, so I did watch it, and I know that at halftime, that was their biggest, UConn's biggest deficit that they've had all year at halftime. It was eight points, which is not a lot, and I thought that UConn was going to pull away in overtime. They didn't. The uh, Mississippi State held on, and the Bulldogs go to their first ever championship. Such a cool story. You would think if that when that game got into overtime, if I'm a Mississippi State fan, you're like, oh, we lost our chance. Yeah. Once it gets Dad into Prescott, overtime, you yeah, Prescott. UConn is gonna pull away. They're, they're, they should win by 21. They didn't. They're gonna win by six in overtime. Mm -hmm. No, still have the guts and the belief yep. after you lost by 60 to this team the year prior. To stand, look them in the face, and knock them out. Kudos to those Mississippi State Bulldog ladies. Yeah, and they snapped that 111 games. That in itself. How many of those games were won by single digits? Like three, maybe? They won three. how many by like 60? Yeah. Like they won like 25 of them by 60. Mm -hmm. They won three of them by single digits. It's just like, 